First of all, I think that if we take the top consulting firms, Benjamin Soltress, Example Investment Banks, and probably other firms, something in the range of 90% of the people are what we call insecure achievers. Insecure achievers are insecure, meaning they're afraid they're not gonna achieve. But because they're afraid they're not gonna achieve, they not only achieve, but they overachieve, right? And so I always say there's a huge difference between good private psychology and good work psychology. I think good private psychology is actually you feeling very comfortable and relaxed all the time and everything will be fine. And by the way, work doesn't matter that much and all those things. And then if you look at how many people have psychology that actually succeed, it's actually the inverse of that. Work probably represents too much. It gives them too much stress and a lot of things, other things that would be great that it didn't do, but it does. And therefore they want to go and deliver, right? Exactly. And then they have a mentality probably very often that is if their stomach hurts a little bit, they don't quit, but they go and try to find out how to solve it. Um, I'm a very big believer that the quality of our lives is determined by the quality of questions we ask, right? Which is what Anthony Robbins says. The quality of our lives is determined by the quality of questions we ask. Why? Because questions work like blingers on a horse, yeah. okay? They create focus. Now, so I think what is the most important thing to work on in the world is not how to answer questions well, but how to ask questions well. Because you can only get the answers that you of the question you ask. You ask somebody, why is this person such an idiot? You will get an answer. You ask, what can I learn from this? You will get an answer. And so I've, I've worked a lot of this, I've been fascinated by this topic of how to ask better questions for the last 10 years. What are some of the best questions to ask? You? So I've now finally found out what I think currently is the best question I'm able to ask, which is who do I or we need to be to achieve X? Exactly. Right? Yeah. So if you say, look, I wanna have, I wanna build a world-class um, uh, podcast, which I can live off of, let's say that was your goal, you, know, you could say, who do I need to be in order to to achieve that, yeah. right? What do what do we need to do to achieve that? Yeah. Um, and I think that's such a good question because it opens up to a world of possibility where everything is possible and where all you're trying to find out is that. 